I'm playing Limbo over there, so hopefully that's not making too much noise. But anyway, um, so alternative channels is a term I think I heard once, or just alt channels for short. For It's a term for people who start their second channel, and um, normally what happens is uh let's let's go to bigger youtubers they'll make content and then they'll be like oh i have all these people who want more but at the same time if i make too much more everyone's gonna be like oh no fuck this guy and we'll unsubscribe so i'll just make a second channel and just give out that little extra bit of content for people and it doesn't even have to be that good because the only people we're watching are people who watch the fuck out of it no matter what and, um, since then, YouTube's algorithm has changed a lot. And, uh, I think, if anything, just making the most videos, longer videos, all that type of shit, might be a bonus. You, I mean, as long as you're making content that every single one of your subscribers will watch every single time, it, uh, which is gonna be fucking impossible, YouTube's fucking impossible. So that's why I try to just... Do what I do, and don't worry about it, you know, I will worry about it, and I'll get depressed that I'm not getting whatever, or I'll be like, why does this video have all these views, but this video that I worked much harder on has fucking nothing. I try to just wipe that clean as much as I can, and not worry about it. Like, this channel has way more views, or not way more, but more views than my actual hard-working channel. Um, and same with, uh, Soul Music, uh... And so I think there, there was a point when some of the YouTubers, YouTubers I started watching, their second channel started to become more of uh, this really amazing, like, pet project. It's like, the main channel is the professional side, and, like, YouTube is just a meta, like... YouTube just is reacting to shit. There's hard, There's very little actual original content. It's more people reacting to other shit. Um, even my reviews are just kind of reacting to shit. Or even just, uh, like, uh, like, PewDiePie, he's playing games. The game theory, they're doing theories of games. Uh, every... I, I, there's a lot of that, right? And even if your uh, content creator is like Smosh, who I guess kind of makes original content, there's still half their videos are about something that the video is based around. Because you need those tags, bro. Um, so, uh, going back on track. The alternative channels is where they don't have to worry about anything and they know they don't have to edit as much and it's ultimately a lot more real of an experience. Like, I think my first introduction to alt channels were, they're mostly just daily vlogs and a lot of YouTubers, they just cram whatever little free time they can into a daily vlog and that'll get a bunch of views and they're like, okay, cool. Um, and I, th and I think, uh, the needle drop, Anthony and Fantano, he was like the first alt channel where I, I subscribed to him. I'm just like, what the fuck are you doing? Because his alt channel is basically the weirdest, like, uh, he does the weirdest videos and Sometimes you'll just make 10 videos of a certain thing and then scrap that idea or he'll just do his main channel stuff but it's on a smaller degree and it, I, like, it's all over the place. And it's like you can do whatever you want and you can experiment unlike the main channel. Although I, I do, it, uh, and I think I'm in that vein too. And I do try, I... I am trying to experiment with the main channel, but at the same time, I want it to be uh, professional and I want it to be um, my main thing, but uh, I don't think as many people like that, unfortunately. Um, and I think even with YouTube, people are just fucking lazy. Like, they don't want to, like, sit down and have their attention 
like be completely focused. They want to just put some shit on in the background and hear people ramble and then just go on to the next thing and it's um yeah. And then other old channels, I know uh Digibro uh is a guy who basically does these very analytical uh anime videos and they're um very smart and uh put I'm describing this terribly. But on his second channel, he kind of just does uh, similar to what I, these past couple ones I've been doing. They're just these very um, straightforward vlogs about something. And it's just kind of him throwing an idea out there. And like they're very interesting ideas. And just kind of giving his two cents. And very quick and easy. And another YouTuber... And this is the funniest fucking thing. His name is Sai, and he just kind of does gaming and a little bit of anime c content, and very, also kind of in that analytical kind of vein. Basically, he started a second channel, and I'm just like, this is exactly like fucking Digibro. And then literally, he made a video, and in that video, he's like, so I've been watching this guy named Digibro, and I'm kind of just a a aspiring to do what he's doing. And, um, uh, and he's very open about that, which was awesome. And, uh, so, and so that was very cool, just to see someone's influence immediately, and just, like, uh, someone who I knew, but, uh, knew of, I didn't have it very many connections connecting these two people, but I, I immediately saw what he was doing, I was like, I know what you're doing. I know who you've been watching. And, uh, so yeah. And then with this second channel, um, that I have, I can do videos, that, quick and easy videos that I don't mind doing, and I know it'll get thousands of views, or at least hundreds of views. Um, or if I just have, like, a day off, and I just watch, uh, some real quick, and just do a quick video on it, and it's new, I know it'll get a bunch of views. Or I could just do, um, like, I've reviewed short films, and it's like, I can't do a main video on that on the main channel. Let's do a video like this. Or I can just, I, I can do anything on this fucking channel, and it's fucking awesome. And it's my fucking second channel. I don't give a shit if it gets views, you know? And I think that's ultimately the beauty of alt channels, and I honestly think... Like, because whenever I get invested to a, invested into a YouTuber, I get invested in their personality, and I think they're a cool-ass person, I want them to have an alt channel. I wish every YouTuber had an alt channel. And, uh, the, maybe not all, but I want that option, you know? And, um, a lot of them do. Because, um, when you're... When, when you have a creative outlet and YouTube nowadays because we have to worry about algorithm and uh, every video being clickable and all this shit, it ultimately becomes um, st stressful and you kind of are forced to make a certain kind of video and the creative outlet part diminishes a little bit and so that second channel where you get to do whatever you want, go fucking ape shit, man. Nobody gives a shit. And ultimately, I think people need to not worry about their main channel uh, being so every video is clickable. And because in the end, just uh, do what you're gonna do. The people who like you, if you have a Patreon, they'll stick around for that. And as long as you're not uh, like tarnishing what you're doing. And you're still doing it, and people like it, and they'll continue to fucking do whatever. Of course, um, like, I've seen videos by a person who was like, I've been doing this for 10 years, uh, I remember being the top 50 channels ever, I don't make shit views anymore, I wasn't even invited to VidCon this year, and I'm just like, that's, that's, that's YouTube. That's YouTube. Um, and that's just so unfortunate. And if 
you have a second channel though. You can make whatever you want. As that's that's why that's the format I strive for. I just want my main thing. People can like it or they can't. Don't really give a shit, but if I can just have a Patreon and that pays my bills eventually and I can do this full time, that's the dream right there. And then my second channel will cover any other outlets of creative outlets I aspire to. I need to look more at the camera. Um, this, oh god, this was a terrible, this was a terrible rambling video. And I'm probably not going to edit it at all. And then I'm going to upload it. And then people are going to watch it. That's how fucking these, the alt channels work. It's weird, you know? Ah. <sighs> It's fucking amazing though. I don't, I, that should probably, I, should, I probably should have just ended the video on that and then cut to black, but I'm probably gonna end it how I ended every other video. And with that, I leave you. Now that I, see this, uh, I didn't say it good enough and on the main channel I'll do like three, four takes, but on this one, fuck it. Ah. Jesus Christ, what am I doing?